Hi, and welcome to wigs.com fall for the best season picks for the hottest styles that you will see everywhere. I'm Carlise, and this is our tribute to the iconic Fashion Week event where the best are represented for the upcoming fall season. The styles we're going to be highlighting today are the ones that you have made our best sellers, plus some ones that we think are climbing to the top with a bullet. So the new trends in color are going to be warm blends and you're going to see richer, darker colors. Of course, blondes still reign. Today we are going to be highlighting all synthetic wigs as they suit our busy lifestyles. They're ready to wear right out of the box with minimal effort and make life super easy. Synthetic wig, synthetic fiber is weatherproof and so the curl pattern is baked right in so humidity and rain won't bring you down. Okay, keep in mind that we are showing the hottest styles and the trends as we here at wigs.com are privy to those trends as they're developing. So you will see them here first. I may miss some details on some of the wigs you might consider your favorites, but the good news is every wig has its own product page with lots of details and everything you need to know before you decide if it's the right style for you. Okay, so guys, this is my first time to do a live feed, so go easy on me. Um, we do want your comments and your feedback because I would like to do this again in the future if I don't botch it today. So stick with me, and here we go. Okay, first out is Ignite by John Renault. Sophia is wearing Ignite, and it's an angled bob cut that looks so chic. I love the way this frames your face. Guys, if you have great cheekbones, this one shows them off beautifully. It's a short style, but you still have length that moves beautifully. It's a heat-friendly synthetic, but don't forget, don't go over 350 degrees. I personally love the way it's styled. I wouldn't change a thing, but in case you want to, you have that option. Lace front is ready to wear. This means you do not have to cut it yourself. And just FYI, all our styles that we're showing today are ready to wear lace front styles. Okay, this is a basic cool cap and it makes it really affordable. I'll show you the cap in just a second. Um, Sophia, come have a seat and let's talk about that cap. Hi. Say hi. Okay, what color are you wearing? I'm wearing the 1426 S10. Perfect. It's the light golden blonde with the medium gold and blonde blend and brown rooted on yours. Of course, this one isn't. This color is 1B, and I just wanted to show you the cap. The inside of the cap is beautiful. It has wefts and open. You can breathe. It's cool, and it also makes it a little more affordable, this cap construction, but you lose no quality as the lace front still gives you the most realistic look. Great, how does that one feel? It feels great and it's such a great transition in the face. Yeah, so. you look beautiful in it. Thank you. Okay, Sophia, thank you so much. That's Ignite by John Renault. Next up, we have Downtime by Raquel Welch. Raquel Welch is, of course, known for her gorgeous, fashionable wigs. This is their longest hand knotted wig to date. Hand knotting means it gives a supernatural look to the hair and gives you lots of versatility. This one is definitely one you have to feel to believe. It is super long that you can look at it and see how great the movement is. Go ahead and give it a spin. See this movement? There you go. Give it a shake for them to get a sense of what it feels like. The soft lace front gives her a natural looking front hairline and the synthetic hair is, it's, it's an average size, oh let me forget that, it's an average size and it's about 21 inches long. This one is really long, so keep in mind, synthetic hair, just like our own hair, is amazing, but it does tend to tangle and frizz if we don't take good care of it. So be sure to take good care of it. Use a wide tooth comb. I personally don't recommend brushing with a brush at all. Um, it's a little more effort, girls, but totally worth it, this one. It is a new style, but already one of our favorites. A super relaxed wave. So Katie, this one's a new one. 
How do you like it? Oh my gosh, I love this. It looks really pretty. I love the dark color. It makes me feel really sexy, really beautiful. And I think if you had um, eyes that you really want to make pop, that nice dark color can do that. It's beautiful. Thank this you. is a, what color is this? This is SS4 slash 6. So, so it's just a rich chocolate blend. Yes, and it's beautiful. got that dark brown root as well. Beautiful, beautiful. So this color that I'm pulling out right now is the 1488 Golden Wheat. Um, most of you already know this color, really popular color with Raquel Welch. And I just wanted to shake it out and show you how this feels. It's beautiful. Inside, it's completely hand knotted. I mean, it feels like butter. So I love this one. Love it, love it. Okay, good, thank you so much. This was Downtime, Raquel Welch. Thank you, Katie. Next, we have Scarlet by John Renault. Scarlet's a beautiful mid-length cut that should fall just above the shoulders. And it's about 11 and a half inches long, but remember, it will fall differently depending on the length of your neck. We will get comments from time to time about the wigs not looking like the picture on them or, or they think it's a different wig. Everyone has a different face shape, a different neck length different forehead sizes. So this can affect how the wig looks on each individual. Good thing Scarlett looks good on almost anyone though. She also comes in a large size and a petite size. Are you guys noticing a trend here with the relaxed wave styles? You'll see it throughout this whole show. Waves are everywhere. This one is definitely a full head of hair guys, but it's gorgeous and it feels really natural. The smart lace front gives you a more natural hairline and the basic open cap means the cap is sewn using open wefts like I showed you just a minute ago which gives you a really cool and breathable wear and because it is not monofilament it's a little bit more affordable but still looks great. Okay Roxy let's talk about your color. Yes. It's one of my favorites. Yes I love this color and it looks a lot like my own too so even yeah. my own friends I'll wear this wig all the time and they don't even know and then I'll tell them, they're like, oh my gosh, I cannot believe it. So it's 24 by 22, medium golden blonde with a little highlight. Yeah, and it looks yeah. beautiful. How's it feel? I love it. I don't even know I'm wearing one. Good. Yeah, this curl pattern is mm -hmm. everywhere. And it looks yeah. really good on anybody. All ages, all face mm -hmm. shapes. I really like and it. And you can kind of wear a little pin to it mm -hmm. and let, or put it, I, I even put it back in a pony sometimes. Yeah, I like to put so, a little side braid in yeah. there too. So that looks good. Well, that's beautiful it. on you, Roxy. Thank you. Again, this one's Scarlet mm -hmm. by John Renault. Thank you. Our next one is Tab by Ellen Villa. So most of you guys know Ellen Villa. She has an amazing attention to detail. This precision short razor cut is stunning. And you can play with the bangs any way you want because it's a lace front looks completely natural at the front hairline. You can push them straight up and back for, off your face, or for an edgier look, you can do a you can do a bit of styling gel and play with those gorgeous layers. The monofilament crown and lace front gives you a natural look where the scalp is visible. Again, we're showing you another one with open wefts and a flower neck top, which means it just keeps the construction of the cap a little bit more affordable but you still get an amazing cut. You get a high-end look at a better price. Sophia, let's see, tell me about this one. I love this one. It reminds me of um, Emma Watson with the pixie yeah. cut. It's very cute. Yeah, that, very that, that's what it looks like. Um, sand Rooted, is that the color? Yes. Okay, good. So Sand Rooted is, um, so it's a little bit of a honey, a warm, turn around, let's see. Yeah, it's a warm blonde. Um, it's got some gold blonde roots. It's rooted, it's dark at the roots, which yes. I like and I think makes the color look so much more natural. I, I really like it. I agree. Yeah. How does it feel cool? All these lights, I'm kind of getting hot, but you look really cool. I know, I am. <laughs> oh, it's beautiful. It looks beautiful on you. Okay, this is Tab by Ellen Villa. Thank you, Sophia. Thank you. Next is one of my favorites, Sarah by John Renault. It's a gorgeous, relaxed, beachy wave. It is also synthetic, so the curl pattern is baked right in there. You are not gonna lose those gorgeous curls no matter what the weather. It is lace front and mono top, which gives you really good movement, very natural look. 
So a mono top or monofilament top means the hairs are individually sewn in and knotted in, sometimes in groups of two or three, but definitely knotted in so that it comes out of the scalp looking completely natural. It's a very sheer material, so when you look down into the part, it looks really natural. It's very hard to tell it's a wig. So it's, it gives you beautiful movement. Personally, I wouldn't wear a wig unless it had a mono top. I think it's just the most natural look ever. We're seeing waves in big demand everywhere, and this is one of my favorites. The length, perfect, it's 15 to 17 inches, so it's a long one. I'm gonna show them the back, see where it falls. Again, everybody's built differently, but it should fall somewhere around the bra strap. We do very little to these wigs, guys. We basically just pulled them out for today. We pulled them out, shook them out a little bit, maybe did some finger styling, and that is it. There is no altering of these. What you see is what you get right out of the box. You can get these looks really easily. Okay, Katie, come, let's talk about this color. All right, so I'm wearing the 10 RH16. Like you said, this beachy wave, I just feel like I kind of stumbled in off the day, you know, hanging out on the water. But then this nice little highlight, I feel like gives it such good dimension and I feel just really vibrant with this hair. It's beautiful, it looks really yeah. good. Can I, yeah, yeah, absolutely, it's so touchable. <laughs> yeah, it looks really good. And you can leave the, the waves PC like that, yes. or you can really just kind of run your fingers through them and mm -hmm. give them a smoother look if you want to also. Absolutely, we did a sweet little pin too, so you can style it, have it off your face on one side, or if you like that sexy look down in front, you can do that too. So we just had a question come in that said, um, is this a is this highlighted, is this streaked? This is a brown, so this is not a blonde, it's a brown, but it's got 33% blonde highlights in there. So they are pretty PC looking, so you can definitely tell that it's they're highlighted. Great salon looking highlights. Beautiful, beautiful. Thank you, Thank you so much. Thank Again, you. this is Sarah by John Renault. Okay, you guys, I keep saying this about these wigs, but this one really is one of my absolute favorites. I wear this one definitely a couple of times every month for sure. It's my go-to. It is a timeless favorite for millions of you guys out there too. One of our always lands at the top. It comes in average and large size too, so it fits everyone. It's a shoulder grazing bob with just the perfect amount of layers, monofilament top, but it's a 100% hand tied cap, which means, gosh, I wish y'all could feel it. It's just super soft and feels beautiful. Not all mono is hand tied, you guys, so make sure that you note that. Some are machine made, but this one is 100% hand tied. And the lace front hairline, makes it really, really easy to get different options, different styling. You guys have seen this one everywhere. Celebrities wear this. I'm not sure if we're allowed to say which ones, but celebrities definitely wear this one. We feature it in many of our ads because it's beautiful and everyone loves it and it looks good on almost every face shape. It is, like I said, a go-to style for me. I love to wear it slicked back. So I take some pretty heavy gel and just slick it all the way back, kind of that Heidi Klum look and I really love it that way. People even here at the office can't tell that it's the upstage when I, I'm done with it. So there's lots of versatility with this one. And the synthetic fiber is heat friendly, so you can do whatever. I love it the way it is, but again, the girl should always have options. So it is a sophisticated one for sure. Roxy, you love this one, don't you? I'm obsessed with yeah, this one. This one's great. Especially the color, it's RL527. Yeah, ginger brown, yes. beautiful. And this little highlight right here, mm -hmm. that's my favorite. Cause it just kind of brightens up my face. Especially the 100% hand tie, you can literally wear this style a yeah. hundred different it ways. It's really good. It looks back, really good. like you said, I've seen it in that one that looks beautiful. I love it like that, so yes. it is one of my favorites. So this one, different color, shaded wheat, which I, Again, if you read any of my blogs, you see that I am obsessed with rooted color. They just look so natural when they have a little root to them. But I wanted to show you the wig cap is beautiful. It feels just, I mean, it feels so, so soft. You just don't feel it on you. It's very, very comfortable. Whether you have hair or not, it will be completely comfortable to wear all day. Again, this one is, I don't really have to repeat it. This one's known everywhere, but it's Upstage by Raquel Welch. Thank you, Roxy. Thank you.
Okay, next we have Miranda. This one is such an elegant, long style. It's beautiful. This is a very high-end look, but made affordable by placing the monofilament in just the right place. It's just on the part in the left. It's, it's wide, so you have some styling versatility with where your part lands but you are going to love this one. I mean, the lace front gives you complete natural looking hairline, and it is, of course, that long kind of wave. I wouldn't, I don't know if I'd call it wavy, but it's definitely got body and some bend. It's beautiful. The synthetic hair is the best for minimal styling. It's literally shake and go. Again, the curl pattern's baked right in, but Sometimes you want to just do a little bit to it. You can spritz it with water, do some styling product. I just like to spritz it with water. Um, finger styling or wide tooth comb. Again, do not use a brush. Miranda is about 12 inches in length. It's going to fall differently on everybody, but should go right past your shoulders. I love this one. Sophia, you look great in this. And we are twins today because I'm wearing one too. Yeah, I love it. What color are you wearing? 12 FS8. Okay, absolutely, hands down, one of the most popular blondes we have on wigs.com. Yes. Oh, FSA is beautiful. So it is a light golden brown and natural blonde and pale natural gold blonde blend with a shaded root of medium brown. So, you know, sometimes it's hard because we have lights and the imagery that the client sees on the website sometimes isn't exactly what you get when you, or what you see when you get out of the box. Definitely make sure you guys go outside, look at this color and different lighting because it does make a difference. Your kitchen versus outside will make a difference, but this blonde is gorgeous and looks great on everyone. I'm wearing, oh, what am I wearing? And again, I just put this one right out of the box. So I literally shook it and put it on. So, I, so forgive me if it doesn't look perfect, but this is what it looks like right out of the box. This one is color 27S4. Nope. Sorry, 30A27S4, shaded peach. That's easier to remember. Shaded peach in Miranda. Looks beautiful. This is Miranda by John Renault. Thank you. Okay, next is Star by Ellen Villa. Okay guys, this one is when you wanna go up a notch. This is part of the Hair Society collection that Ellen Villa just launched here in the United States. These are 100% handmade pieces and they are gorgeous. The cap construction, impeccable. But I'll get to that in just a minute when you sit down. These were crafted for women with partial to permanent hair loss and it should fit like a glove and they do. It's also a hit for those that need a petite size wig. That was almost a tongue twister. Okay. <laughs> Star is a sleek chin length bob that is, it really is stunning. It looks great. It looks so natural. You will not believe that it's a wig. It's, I have to give a shout out though to Gail who posted the most gorgeous picture of herself in the star on wigs.com. It's beautiful. You guys, you guys have to go look at it. it. It looks like a produced picture, but she just clicked and sent. Beautiful. Keep in mind that Ellen Villa collection wigs, especially the Hair Society, are focused on a more natural look, which means there's a lower density. Okay, these pieces are crafted to be undetectable as wigs. Okay, some of you out there are used to, or may like, or just may prefer that big hair look, and many feel more comfortable with a higher density piece, and that's okay. Um, we all get to like what we want, but there are choices out there for you, right? The Ellen Villa, however, is a very European high-end design. It's, well, she's European, so that would make sense. So if you want to lower the density, if you want to lower density, this uber natural look is definitely a designer to check out. So let's talk about this cap design, Katie. Okay. okay. Again, this is the Star by Hair Society. Yes. And this came straight out of the box, right? Yes, put it, it right did. On you. It did. And I'm wearing the dark sand mix, okay. which I love. I think it's so chic. This style kind of makes me feel like posh spice a little bit, like I could be running around the streets of Fashion uh, Week yeah, with this. It looks, so I love it. It looks beautiful on oh, you. Really, you. really pretty. It's a warm blonde, yes. but it also it's it's not brassy. It's a beautiful, no, beautiful it, color. It and the inside of this cap is gorgeous. You guys have. I I just wish there was 
feel vision in here, you can feel it. It's really, really pretty. And the way it's designed is to hug the back, the nape, so that it is, there is no slippage. It feels really natural. There is almost nothing between you and the hair. Yeah. It's, it's beautiful. It feels really, like really my pretty. own, which is nice. It, yeah, and it exactly. looks gorgeous on you. Just kind of shake yeah. it for me. Just don't, don't be afraid. Just give it a good shake. There you go. It looks beautiful. <laughs> Thank you. Really, really good. Okay, Thank guys, so this is much. Star. Ellen Villa, and that's the Hair Society collection. Next is Brianna by Envy. Waves are definitely, as we pointed out, the go-to look for women of all ages, everywhere. Anyone can wear them. This is a long layered style, and it's beautiful. The Brianna's about 17, I believe, yes, yeah, 17 inches in length at the longest point. It is one sexy long look for sure. This, the long bangs, there's long bangs that blend beautifully into this. So they are, yeah, they are, gosh, man, that's so pretty. The designer is Alan Eaton, and he is the creator of Envy Hair. He is definitely one of the greats and helped Revlon make a name for itself in this industry. He founded Envy about, I'm gonna get this wrong, about five years ago and we just love his designs. His attention to detail is great. They're, they just, great response to what the client wants. He's got a great gift for designing wigs. The hair moves, moves beautifully, and that is a monofilament top. That helps that gorgeous movement, and the lace front. Listen, if you want the most natural looking front hairline, you, you have to go with lace front, guys. There just isn't any other way to get that natural look unless you're totally covering up your forehead, and there are some styles out there with bangs that don't need the lace front, your front hairline will be what makes or breaks you as far as, is this a wig? Right? That, well, that and the overly shiny hair, again. So, and all wigs will have shiny hair, but it does, it will wash out after one or two washes, but we also like to do just a little spritz of dry shampoo, and that will, tone down that shine right away. And we did that with many of the wigs here today. It doesn't mean that the wig quality is not good, it's just when they come right out of the box, that helps give it a more natural look. The bright lights here and the new wigs, um, a little bit of spritz on that dry shampoo makes them look perfect. Roxy, you look amazing in this Thank one. Thank you. This is a, I'm gonna make a statement look Yes, sure. this is, I'm going out on the town. Yeah. And that looks really good a on nice you. nice sexy dress. What color are you? Cream yeah. coffee. Okay, let me see this one. Yes. Um, this is what the MB boxes look like. And this one is, I mean, just beautiful. Moves beautifully, has great bounce. Again, the synthetic fiber is gonna keep you bouncy, no matter what the weather. Open wefting allows you to breathe great cool wear all day and because it's not monofilament on the whole cap you get a little bit more affordable option there it's monofilament where it counts and lace front is gorgeous and invisible and ready to wear looks beautiful looks Thank great you. on you oh this one this color guys is sparkling champagne beautiful rooted color really pretty another popular color for Alan Eaton and Envy Thank you Roxy Thank looks you. good Okay, next one is Editor's Pick by Raquel Welch. This one is a longtime favorite here at wigs.com, and you guys definitely love it. This shoulder grazing layer bob is beautiful. It's such a great style. It is heat friendly also, which means you can change up the style with heat tools. Just remember guys, with all heat friendly hair, you wanna stay below 350 degrees to be safe. But honestly, I don't know what you would do to this one. I love it exactly the way it is. I wouldn't change this one at all. The soft waves are perfectly done. The temple to temple lace front gives you great natural sweeping front hairline. And the hand tied monofilament top allows for beautiful movement. This one is definitely a full head of waves. It's, I love this color on you, Sophia. It's Thank beautiful. You. What I color are you too. wearing? The RL3335. Now this is what we call a vibrant, yes. vibrant color. It's auburn with a very ruby red highlight throughout. I don't know if you guys can see how vibrant these little highlights are, but
but they're subtle highlights. It really makes the, the auburn just, uh, I never like saying the word pop, but it does make them pop. It does. <laughs> it's really pretty. It's really pretty on you. I never thought red on you, but it I looks, like it. It looks great. Red is one of my favorites. Um, I'm not naturally a redhead, and to make your hair red is a lot of chemical damage, and so I don't have to. Exactly. Like that. <laughs> That's perfect. Um, okay, so this one is Editor's Pick. And again, color 33 slash 35. Thank you, Cynthia. Thank you. Okay, next up we have another Carly, or another Envy, and this style is named Carly. So this is another Allen Eaton design, and Carly is a chic, smooth, and updated bob cut with really sharp, clean lines, but super soft movement. Yeah, it's really, really pretty, really soft. The mono top, of course, adds to the beautiful movement and the natural scalp, scalp appearance. And the bangs give you complete coverage on your forehead. It is a super lightweight. This one is not a lace front, but you don't necessarily need it because you do have bangs there to cover that front hairline. It's super lightweight, very sleek, and easy breezy. And that's what we all want out of our bob haircuts for sure. You want that movement or it just looks kind of helmet-y otherwise. Helmet-y, is that right? Um, this one falls about 11 inches long in length and looks good on just about everybody. Uh, I don't have the nerve to cut bangs in naturally, but I sure can wear that one for a day. It's, it's perfect, it's a perfect bang style. This one looks really good on you, Katie. Thank have you. Have you ever worn bangs before? I have not. Um, I would love to though, which this is such a cool way to be able to do that. Yeah, so it's fun to play with. It's super light. This one for sure has so much movement. I mean, it feels like it's a piece of my head, which is nice. And yeah. I'm wearing um, toasted sesame wheat today, so. Okay. This one color. is um, described as a medium brown. It's got medium brown roots with overall warm cinnamon base and gold blonde lights. Now, I read cinnamon base in here, but I don't see red at no. all. So I think it's a very warm, I see them really, really light. So it just adds a little bit of a warm glow yes. to the whole thing, but there's no red in it. No. So, um, but it's, it looks really, really pretty on you. And it, it brings out the function. gold in your brown eyes. I really like this one. Thank you, Good. love it. Again, Carly by Envy. Thank you, Katie. Okay, so this is the last time I'll say this, and probably because it's the last wig, but this is one of my favorites. This is the Arrow by Ellen Villa. And from all the reviews you guys are leaving, it seems to be a favorite with you guys too. There are just, I don't know anyone who doesn't like this wig. It looks beautiful. I think almost everyone here at the office has it or has worn it. We love this one. Arrow is the perfect wave. It can never be mistaken for curly. And it's a very relaxed wave, very, very subtle, but it's unmistakably wavy. It has a monofilament part and lace front and just gorgeous natural movement. Go ahead and take a spin for them mm -hmm. so they can see all of it. The length is about 13 to 14 inches. It looks longer on Roxy than when I wear it, so I, it, it does vary depending on who's wearing it, but I love this length. Um, if any of you have read my long hair after 40, do or don't blog post. This one is definitely a do. The movement on this arrow is impeccable. Like all Ellen Villa pieces, you will get less density and a more natural look as a result. But the curl pattern gives such great volume. It does not look thin at all. It looks very natural, but it's beautiful volume. I, I love this one. Gorgeous, it looks beautiful on you, Roxy. Thank you. Come tell us what color you're wearing. This is Caramel Lighted. Okay. I love this one, um, especially what you were talking about, the Instagram posts. There's so many people, oh. different skin colors, how you do your makeup, like it just looks beautiful on everybody. Yeah, this one's it's really, one really favorites. popular. Um, Caramel Lighted is described as a dark honey blonde base with golden highlights on top, darker at the nape and shaded roots. That's a long description basically to say that it's a really natural yeah. light brown that looks like it's just been just completely sun bleached yes. out and it looks a lot of beautiful, dimension. really natural, gorgeous, And it's gorgeous. really lightweight too. Like that's one thing about other wigs. Sometimes if you want like a fuller look, like John Renault or Raquel Welch has big hair. Mm -hmm. And sometimes this just makes me feel like I'm not wearing anything at all. So Ellen Villa really killed it with 
the yeah. how lightweight it is. So yeah. it looks That's beautiful. Like it. Well, so most of you probably recognize Roxy. She's always on mm -hmm. our website, um, mainly because she's got such a great face shape. She can pull off anything in any color. But one thing I've noticed is you've really become an expert because yeah. you have hair, but you wear a lot. She's a singer and she wears hair to perform and mm -hmm. you have really, you go from shorts to long yeah. and different colors. That would never be possible. Yeah, you wigs. know, I've definitely grown to love wigs because before when I started working here, I was just like, oh my gosh, I thought it was something that you only did when you got older or if you don't have hair and now it's become an accessory in my life. So I kind of, just like you, like we get our outfits ready and then we pick our wig oh, and absolutely. put our earrings on and mm -hmm. we kind of switch out colors. So that's true. It's Very a lot true. of fun. It's like makeup too. Is so. it? I was just going to say that it is yeah. like makeup. I love it. That's and my favorite. I'm really thankful that you've fallen in love with them instead of just coming in and putting them on yeah. as your job. I see you incorporate them in your life. Um, Thank you. I have too. So yeah. Okay guys. So that was our fall picks for what we think are gonna be the trends that are going to be everywhere. Thank you. You know what, I forgot to mention to hit that follow button. I'm not sure if it's over here or over here, depending on what screen you're looking at. The wigs.com, there's a follow button that will allow you to be the first to know whenever we go live in the future. You'll be part of our community. We won't inundate you with emails, it'll just simply be notifications when we're gonna do a live show. Again, I need your help, I need your feedback. I know I messed it up, I'm sure, at least you know, 10, 15, 30 times. Just help me get better so that we can make it better for you. Thank you.